Well, the city will be handing out 500 free air tags to people in the South Bronx. The goal of this initiative is to prevent vehicle thefts. This is an issue that the city is dealing with because so far this year, vehicle thefts are up 13% compared to the same period last year. For residents of the South Bronx, vehicle thefts are a common occurrence. A car was stolen right there in the corner about three days ago. That's why resident Carmen Perilla is on board with the new city plan, which will hand out 500 air tags across the 43rd precinct in the South Bronx. The goal is to deter and catch car bandits. The area has a significant theft problem. There have been 207 auto thefts since January. The aggravating number of grand larceny auto continues to drive up. Uh, our crime in the city. And it, give, it gives the false sense that we're not moving in the right directions when we are. The Association for Better New York has donated the tags. They track a vehicle's location in real time on an iPhone. Once a vehicle is stolen, the owner can call police and officers will use the owner's phone to track the missing car. The GPS devices donated by ABNY will be given New York as another layer of protection for their vehicles by first locating and tracking stolen cars, then by acting as a deterrent for, crime, for auto thieves. It also allows our officers to be more strategic while mitigating pursuits, keeping us safe, and keeping the community safe. Business owner Robert Cox has used air tags in his work trucks for safety in the past, but he's not sure they're the solution to the problem. The city needs to do something a little bit better than that. Start giving out stiffer jail sentences. Start um, stiff on parole. Stop letting people walk away because the crime is terrible. Carmen Perilla, on the other hand, is hoping to get her hands on a tag. If you go out anywhere in the city, in the Bronx here, you better watch where you park it because they might just take it. The mayor is encouraging anyone who can afford it to get their own AirTag. And if you do not use an Apple iPhone, don't worry, there's also an Android alternative that is available. Reporting from City Hall, Kieran Dillon, PIX11 News.